Hi there, Nick Garner here for 90 Digital and today we're going to go through the 90 Majestic Excel tool. This is a tool that's designed to query Majestic's API. And one of the cool things about this is you can do stuff with this you just cannot do off the Majestic website. So what I'll do first is I'll just quickly go into how you get set up and get going and then I'll do a couple of uh, quick use cases. So the first thing is you got to load up your API key. If you have a paid account from Majestic, you can get an access token, put it in here, and then you're good to go. Just to do, click on the uh, URL here and then go into your account and you can get it all set up. It's very, very easy. The next thing is that you have a whole bunch of controllers here which allow you to do different things. Now, what I've done is I've downloaded all the data from particular tools and uh, I've put them straight into, into Google Docs here. So you can just see what the test data looks like, which is quite useful. So you don't have to use any API credits up or anything like that. You can just have a look at that. The other thing is that anything that's a variable is in a blue box. And the key thing in terms of use cases, the, the key thing I find really, really helpful is the way you can query multiple domains in one hit and then export them straight into Excel without any uh, without any issues. Now, one of the best ones, I think, is probably backlink history. And here I can run any number of data, um, any number of URLs. And what's so cool is that I can then look at the history of a domain right back to the beginning of Majestic. And from that, then I can start to draw some interesting conclusions based on whatever I see. There are other use cases, for example, you can get top backlinks from a whole batch of domains, which is very handy. So again, it saves you a lot of back and forth in Majestic. And you can specify things like number of URLs per domain, number of links per page, and so on. Like I say, it's very powerful, and there are loads of different ways you can use it. Finally, if you are burning up through API credits, you've got this little thing here, which just tells you what you've got left. And that's about it. So thank you very much.